say hi from cherished math. This is the question. A semicircle is inscribed in a right angle isosceles triangle. Given that AC is equal to the square root of 2, find the length of the radius. Let's assume that the length of the AB is equal to X. So, since this is an isosceles triangle, for the length of the BC, that would be the same as the AB. I'm now going to work out for what is the value of the x by using Pythagoras theorem. And that would be x squared plus x squared is equal to the square root of 2 square root up. And I'm getting 2x squared is equal to 2. And the value of the x is 1. Let me draw the radius of the semicircle connecting to the point of tangent over here and I'm going to label it as M here. Since the value of X that I'm getting here is 1, that means BC is a line of tangent at a point B and MC is a line of tangent at the point M. That shows that MC and BC is in the same length which is one unit and now I need to find for what is the value of AM that would be by using the square root of 2 minus 1 since the triangle ABC is an isosceles triangle that makes for the angle A 45 degrees and the angle C here 45 degrees as well now, by looking at this triangle AM and the center of the semicircle O, that left for this angle 45 degrees. Simply because I'm using 180 degrees by taking away the right angle 90 degrees and take away another 45 degrees, this is the angle that left. That shows that it is another isosceles triangle. So, since for the part AM is the square root of 2 minus 1, then for the part OM would be the same as the square root of 2 minus 1. And this is the length of the radius. And I solved the puzzle. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.